No, that, that this was well, painted from the factory. Well, the bigger bikes, the 125, the 250, and the 500 all had an Allen, a flush Allen. This doesn't have a flush bolt. It's got a regular flange head bolt. So they were painted, because I remember the big bikes, the top subframe bolt, the nut and the bolt was painted to the color of the frame, whether it be red or white, they were, they were painted. So on the CR80, the lower uh, uh, subframe bolt was also painted. So that's not touched up. From the factory. Guys, I was all upset. I was like, Chris, we've been shystered. This guy touched up the frame and touched yeah. up the hardware. I was like, what, what? this is amateur hour here. Look at that. But guys, this bike is the real deal. And, and no, nobody could peel these off. They tried peeling them off. The best way to get them off was decal room, a decal remover and it would spray it on. Or you heat them up with a heat gun from underneath and then you peel them off. Nobody knew that. So you couldn't peel them off. Everybody's like, shit, I can't get that sticker off. <laughs> they, they would put a sticker over the sticker. <laughs> Thank God they didn't, they, yeah. they didn't fucking get rid of that. Yeah. Guys, look at this thing. So, Chris, yeah. the decals are a reproduction on the original tank and shroud. I think so. I think so. They don't look original to me. I'm just I had a 95 book. book. Sw swing arm decals confirmed original? I think we so. Those are original. Okay. Yep. This is the original rear sprocket. Original chain adjustment uh, sticker. Okay. And the frame has not been touched up. Guys, look how little wear yeah. is on the frame here. And the, the steering tag. Is still there. Yes, Perfect too. The, the tag is impeccable. Look how shiny it's, the frame is, and no one ever touched it. It's, it's in really good shape. Yeah. So it didn't sit somewhere with oh, moisture in the radiator. All the all the look how straight the radiator is. Yeah. yeah. Look at the frame. All oh, the frame rails are nice too. They are They're really nice. That's why I bought this, Chris. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Pat Pat told me Somebody's he had this place. Somebody's gonna put this in their in their pool room and hang it up on the wall and look at it because they had one and they looped it over backwards when they were a kid. Right. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, tell them what else you found, Chris. Oh, I thought there was a chain roller missing, but then I realized back the 125, the 250, and the 500 stand fits on the 80, but through there. It doesn't have a chain roller. It has a chain slider. Chain slider. Because it's an 85. I'm more used to the bigger bikes because... I was, I was riding bigger bikes. These were too small for me at that point. Right. And way too small. <laughs> Did Shane ever ride one of these or he was on 85s? He went right to a 150R. Uh, okay. CR, the CRF 150R racer, you know, the rippers. Right. Mm hmm. Those are I, nasty. I let him ride his mother's TTI 125 when he was on 65s and he just hooked on four strokes. Oh no. Hooked. Oh no. So. Hey, I was the same way. I was riding, I was riding a KLX 143. Yeah. Uh, and then I jumped right in an 85. So, well, I went to 65s shortly. But, he did. He, yeah. had, he had an RM 65 and he used to leave it at home and race his CRF 70 with a big ball kid in. Really? In 65 class. And he went top five on the thing. I no guess, shit. Yeah, he gets all the two strokes. Hey, man, <laughs> as, a, as a youngster, the fork. And Ricky Ziefeld that told me, he's flying that thing. He's going to blow the shock. When you need a shock, work connect, Works Connection makes one. And he was right. Like two weeks later, two weeks blew, he blew he, the shock. Blew yeah. he, was, he was jumping it and launching it. Yeah, sick. But he loved the four stroke power. It was easier to put the power down. As, you're right. As a young lad, it's less intimidating, all that. Yeah. Starting out. These things are handy. They really are. It's like handing a baby a chainsaw. <laughs> Holy shit. What else did you see on it, Chris? I don't know. Um, There's really not much. I replaced the vent tubes yep. with the original pink pink ones. Nice. So it's back to original and the fuel line. Nice. Um, pipes in good shape too, huh? Pipes, pipes yeah, I don't think it's ever been painted or anything. Oh, man. Yeah. So the, the, seat, the seat is 100% the original cover. And that's the original one, yeah. It's, and it's good. Okay. And the bars as well. Yeah, I think whoever bought this got scared of it and said, Daddy, I don't want to ride it anymore, and cocked <laughs> it, and, and did uh, soccer instead. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, yeah. stay tuned. Okay.